my topic for today's uh, presentation is a single blind clinical study to evaluate the efficacy of herbomineral formulation in the management of arsha myself dr r govind reddy working as assistant director rra podar ayurveda cancer research institute mumbai why i uh, that means uh, this uh, disease has uh, given for uh, our institute because our institute is having uh, the uh, working since 25 years we have the very specialized anorectal opd which attracts uh, almost all 2500 uh, patients annually out of this uh, 1600 patients or from the so arsha like uh, metros like mumbai it's a working population is more there is no support families and there is a social strata for the there is a poor uh, proper uh, toilet facilities these all are the causes for the different types of the arsha are being reported at our opd with uh, very high incidence so with all the possible complications at various stages and uh, the death of the our ayurvedic uh, allopathic uh, treatment there is a no satisfactory conservative management so to avoid this uh, conventional interventions complications the ayurveda based chikitsa gives the better results for this so my objective of this study is the study the efficacy of a classical ayurvedic herbomineral formulations in the management of arsha and the pharmacological studies of the so any adverse drug reactions or any adverse effects of these uh, drugs and any additional benefits of these drugs and to study the symptomatic relief of the periodical at every stage of these patients so these are the material methods we studied the almost all 47 patients uh, we are taken for this clinical trial for the at least for 21 days is the the study period and we are taken the follow up for the every at least interval of 7 uh, days and after this uh, after the study we are taken the every 15 days for up to the 3 months and this study has been carried out on the basis of the selection of the criteria of the patients and exclusion of the cases and we had followed the all the clinical parameters like uh, pain swelling bleeding itching induration swear tenderness and constipation almost all the these symptoms uh, uh, we scored on the four point scale like uh, 0 1 2 3 and uh, like uh, mild moderate and severe and this is was entered in the crf at every stage and uh, the design of this study is a single blind open clinical trial and this is a dura the duration of the trial is is a uh, two years and uh, this is a multi center clinical trial we did in the ccrs almost all 10 units of our uh, centers of the ccrs these are the criteria for the selection of the patients and these are the exclusion of the patients and uh, these are the routine investigations uh, we used to do in our uh, institute like uh, general systemic uh, examinations like a uh, history of the patient we used to take the each and every patient uh, with the detail is to taking and even the local examinations like uh, per rectal examinations proctoscopy if sometimes we to we used to take the sigmoidoscopy also so so each and every patient uh, the uh, evidence based because we used to take the photography with the digital slr camera before middle and after the treatment for the documentation purpose and the, we used to uh, take the all the these pathological and uh, radiological investigations we did on the uh, almost all, all patients this is the criteria for assessment of the uh, patients that is a good response fair response poor response and no response so these are the trial drugs it is a uh, almost all cravyadiras that is a 500 mg tds and trifala churana 5 g at the bed time and kasi sadi tel is a before defecation every 2 ml as a vasti and these all the drugs is uh, supplied by the our ccrs that is a central council for research in ayurveda and siddha as a one of our unit of the uh, patiala they supplied the drugs to the all the multi center clinical trial units these are the contents of the cravyadiras uh, and the, the mode of action of this uh, drug of the cravyadiras is it possesses the properties of the it is a, like a deepen pachan and vatan loman and it is a, especially it is on the krimigna so and uh, the main is uh, the it pacifies the tridoshas there is a tridosha shamana and the, the main cause to factor of this arsha is i already explained it is in the mandagni and amadosha but this 
Kravya virus, it is improves the digestive function and eliminates the amadosha and the vatanulomana brings the action back to the normalcy of the upon vayu. That's why that there is a relief uh, is uh, between the there is an intra-abdominal pressure and the, this uh, this drug is having the very good antimicrobial uh, action. That is a crimigna in this. Uh, that is a correction in the infection due to the hemorrhoids. It's a pathological manifestations. This is the cosisaditel. These are the contents of the cosisaditel and the cosisaditel. The action of the cosisaditel is it is a very good cytogenic drug. That means it is an extra tissue deprement in action and is a very good vrana shodhan and vrana ropan and it will give the very good uh, relief in the pain and as well as the swelling and the local congestion and it hel helps in the very fast uh, uh, healing of the wound also. Trifala, everybody knows there is a laxative action, estrogen and abandonment. These are the ahara is explained by our acharyas that is the patya and apatyas. And uh, these are the some of the uh, pictures I had taken from the digital camera of the before the treatment and after the treatment. I will show you this. Uh, these are the pictures of the some of the patients. And the, this is a uh, uh, observations and results of the my study. So we had taken the 47 uh, patients out of the 47, as uh, so almost all 15 patients uh, from the 41 to 50 years group. And even though. Duration of the illness, we have taken the duration of the illness as a one to a one year, less than one year, one to two years, two to three years, more than three years. And uh, in our study, out of 47, 80, 18 patients from the one to two years, and the, even Prakriti has also we have taken. So 18 patients of uh, uh, Kafaja and 18 patients in Vat Pitaja out of 47. This is the personal history also I had taken for this uh, st study. As, uh, especially we found the more patients is the non-vegetarian patients and uh, spicy intake and the all, almost all, all the patients have the irregular bowel habits and constipated and the, these are the position of the hemorrhoids there's a 3 and uh, 11 o'clock is almost all 22 patients we found out of 47 and uh, these are the statistical analysis and changes in the clinical findings of uh, my study to there's a plain bleeding swelling itching constipation tenderness and duration hemoglobin all the t values of these all the symptoms is a very highly significant and the p value is uh, less than 0 0.001 and even though hemoglobin is also the uh, percentage of the hemoglobin is also increased with the our data is the overall treatment response wise like a good response fair response poor response no response out of 47 almost all 24 patients is a good response and 17 patients is a fair response poor response is 5 and one is a no response these are the graph of the overall treatment of the response in my conclusion in my discussion almost all 32 patients out of 47 patients we found is the non vegetarians and the patients were found in spicy food so this is uh, the combination of this trial would act uh, systematically local upon the anorectal piles and is a synergetic action reduce the varicosity of the venous plexus and there is a already explained the dearth of the allopathic uh, treatment is there is no standard treatment is available so this is the non-invasive comparative ayurvedic medical management with the kravya diras kasi tel and uh, trifala churn have the we studied and it has the proved the very good efficacy in the treatment and this is the follow-up out of 47 42 patients were followed for three months and they did not reported any complaints about the any symptoms and there was any uh, adverse drug reactions and i acknowledge to my director general dr ramesh babu sir uh, they're giving the opportunity to talk in front of you and uh, my deputy director dr padi sir and uh, dr ps tathir sir uh, my teacher of uh, dean of uh, uh, YMT Ayurvedic Medical College and uh, my in charge of uh, my institute Dr. A.D. Jado sir and all my senior officers from our CCRS uh, be here so thank you thank you very much to everybody and these are the references and my thanks to chief patron of uh, this uh, chairperson of this uh, session and thank you thank you very much and hi thanks to my son Master Anvikethreddy thank you thank you very much <laughs>